Hi, I'm Nick Weiss, and today we're going to talk about Other Side by the Red Hot Chili Peppers. It's one of my favorite beginner songs to work on, uh, especially considering it's one of the easiest Chili Peppers songs out there, and Flea's a great bass player, so it's a, it's a lot of fun to get going uh, with one of these songs. It's also a great workout for the pinky, so let's get going. Uh, fifth fret on the E string is where we start. You'll notice that I have a, I have a, actually have a five string bass here, but I uh, took the fifth string off so as to not confuse you. So I've just got the regular E, A, D, G strings that you would normally see. So fifth fret on the E string is uh, the first note. We play that three times. All right. The, four, the fourth note is third fret on the E string. You're going to use your pinky there as well. So pinky. Fifth fret on the E, pinky down to the third fret on the E. It's normal to avoid using your pinky when you're a beginner, but don't. You're just never going to be taken seriously in the long run if you don't have to do it. You're going to have to learn it eventually, so start right away. Let that be a lesson to you. <laughs> so uh, fifth fret, third, and then we go down to first on the E string four times. All right? So it's five, 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 three, one, 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 one. Then we go up to third fret on the A string four times, then back to third fret on the E string four times. All right, so all together, we've got five, 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 three, one, 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 one. Then third on the A string, then third on the E string. All right, so all together. So that is the chorus of the song. This song actually begins on the chorus, which is somewhat unusual. The next section of the song is the verse. We're going to start that on fifth fret of the E string, but we're going to use our first finger now. So you can take a breath. <laughs> and then we're going to play that eight times. And then now we're going to go up to ninth fret on the G string with our pinky and play that eight times. Hear the notes here. Fifth fret on E, ninth fret on G. All right, eight times each. And then the verse ending is simply G held out, which is third fret on the E string, not to uh, confuse you. But uh, the third fret on the E string is G, the name of that note. You hold that note out, and then fifth fret on the E string, the name of that note is A. So it's third fret, fifth fret, both on the E string. All right? So all together, we've got our chorus that we begin with. goes through either four or eight times and then we go to our verse about four times I believe and then we have a uh, an ending phrase which is third and fifth fret on the E string they do that different times throughout the song so sometimes they might just do it once sometimes they do it three times uh, you have to use your ear and uh, uh, you know maybe write down how many times they use it each time they go to it. So uh, let's play along with the song a little bit. Let them go through it once so we can get the timing. Hello, hello. We does play some variations, but 
We're not going to talk about those yet. Now to the verse. There is one other section of the song which is called a bridge. Uh, it's quite a bit harder, so I'll play that uh, uh, slowly here so some of the more advanced students might be able to pick it up, but uh, it's a little bit too much for a beginner lesson. But um, uh, here it is slowly. Thanks so much for watching. I'm Nick Weiss. See you soon.